Hello and welcome to another episode. Um, I'm not having much time to do videos this week. It's, it's Easter and there's other things going on and I'm decorating. Um, it's just an update on the battery conditioning update rollout in the UK. Um, quite a few have had it done and it's working successfully for them. Um, I've been trawling around for the details to, so you can pass it on to your dealer so they can actually find it. Um, I asked John Godfrey on the Kia Owners Club uh, thread about this and he says the dealer master tech simply search for the preconditioning updates that's not the service desk so that's how they find it and the details I have are uh, 950.cv BMS for battery conditioning function um, it, this updates the current version 5208 to 5408 and also CV VCU software up upgrade that's the vehicle control unit CVE 0-SD2-V4000 and those are the two. Um, the successful sign that you it actually has taken the upgrade properly is that winter mode has gone. That should become battery conditioning mode. If that hasn't happened, then they need to go back and do the BMS update. What, what, for what I've been reading on the Ionic 5 forums, they have to roll back to the version you had and then reapply using the uh, Kia update tool in manual mode where you've got to put the password in and reapply the new update. There's been a couple it come out with winter mode and it's not working. So uh, in that anyway, I'll put a link to the Ionic forum and uh, which has got that information on. And uh, fingers crossed it's the same uh, fix to get proper battery conditioning mode on. And um, there's also a couple of um, Hyundai Ionic 5 um, TSBs come out with the same information and what they should be looking for on the screen to confirm it's done it. Um, and they also confirm they fixed the eco mode problem that the Ionic 5s are having after the condition update. Anyway, I'll, I'll put quite a few links to all of these forum threads uh, so you can read yourself. Um, this, I've passed this information on to my dealer, so you know, I hope that they can find it in time for my um, fixes of, that my car's in for next week. And uh, fingers crossed, we all get the update soon. Anyway, thanks for watching.